Hey, Star Wars Vintage Dude here. Hope you're great. Hope you're fantastic. Hope life is treating you well. I uh, went to the storage unit this uh, past weekend and I got a surprise for you here. So let's check this out. I can already tell by the outside of it that there's a whole bunch of like color of course too. But let's dig in here and see what uh, we've got. Um, looks like on the top, we've got some old frame promos. These were when I was a kid. These came from like Burger King or something like that. Is the Empire. And I'm framed hanging on my wall. Scene from Hoth. I think we went to like some place and uh, some some fair or something like that, and they drew uh, a character of me back in the day. Looks like we have a carrying case from the Power of the Force line. This one comes with Wedge Antilles. I know there's a second one that I have too that is with the uh, Imperial Scanning Pilot. Uh, at the top here we've got. Cinema scenes, we've got the Minoc Hunt, which is a great piece. Real fun, that was a great scene from the Cantina. And if you look at, or not from the Cantina, from uh, Empire, it comes with that Minoc, which was great. Such a fun scene. Very cool, the Minoc Hunt. Um, we've got a expanded universe, which was a neat line that kind of came out around this time. Did some concept art from uh, some of the artists, Ralph McQuarrie, I think maybe. Who designed that? Of course, never used in the movie, but the prototype eventually of what the uh, snow speeder came out to. Huh, got an old receipt from Target. Power of the Force two. Geez, four seventy nine a figure. This is back in the day. From nineteen ninety eight. Oh my god! All right, got the Dewback, which is one of my favorite pieces as a kid. That was super hard to find. This comes with a stormtrooper. The um, with a pauldron, with the sand trooper actually is what that one is, and that one goes with a gray pauldron, and he's got some dust on him, some sand on him. It's a fun piece. And let's see, oh, we've got another, I couldn't, I tell you, sort of like a dime a dozen. The gunner station, the Han Solo gunner station, looks like I've got an old Pez dispenser in there, Stormtrooper Pez dispenser, with some unused Pez. We have, oh, this is a heavy one. Oh my gosh. This is a 3D puzzle of Darth Vader. Sweet. This is also the Power of the Force line. It has that same green uh, packaging, it looks like. Power of the Force 2, it's a puzzle. But real neat piece there. It's got the Empire scene. Super cool. And, oh, we've got a whole bunch of comics. Let's check it out. Let's see what we have here. All right. This is new. All right, let's see what we got. We've got Star Wars Heir to the Empire. Sweet. Timothy Zahn, Heir to the Empire. Looks like issue one. That's with the new Grand Admiral Thrawn, X-Wing Rogue Squadron, a Phantom Affair. Phantom Affair, very cool. Let's see what this one is. X-Wing Squadron, the Phantom Affair. Uh, another Phantom Affair, very cool. I haven't... I think I've read some of these. Another Heir to the Empire. This one is issue three. Heir to the Empire, issue four. Five. It's great. Um, six. They're like fun, fun adaptions. I know I've read these at some point. Oh, it looks like we have a Dark Horse Comics Presents. There's The Predator, which is one of my favorite. Uh, Tales of the Jedi, the Frida Nad Uprising. That looks pretty sweet. Tales of the Jedi, Dark Lords of the Sith. That looks pretty cool, too. Tales of the Jedi again. Dark Lords of the Sith. Cool. These are all from Dark Horse. I know that it was way prior to Disney and stuff like that. Tales of the Jedi. Number one. It looks like I got two ish of those. $5 cover price at the time. Looks like I've got a card, cool, Tales of the Jedi, and Empire's End. So that was what was in this box. Oh, holy smokes, look at this. Wait a minute, hold a minute, hold a minute. We've got Bib Fortuna, the day one of Wanga. All right, sweet, no staff or anything like that. Head is still attached. I had one of these where the head popped off. I just played with it too hard. Got some loose legs here, but hey, overall fun piece. Great for my collection. And it looks like 
that's about it. There's some old garbage in there. All right, cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. Star Wars Vintage Dude out. I will catch you on the next round. Take care.